Okay, last news. Egyptian actor's transgender son sued for Instagram post about LGBT activist suicide. Two Egyptian lawyers filed a lawsuit against Noor uh, Hashem uh, Selin, son of film and television store star uh, Hashem Selin, after he posted a video on Instagram in response to the death of exiled Egyptian activist Sarah Hagazi, who's death we um covered last week quote it is a conspiracy against egypt to give up our culture and morals and let homosexuality spread amongst young people uh amen mahus uh one of the two lawyers who filed the lawsuit said strict action should be taken up against people who seek to destroy egyptian values and religious beliefs he added while homosexuality is not outlawed in egypt it is obviously a conservative muslim society and discrimination against lgbt groups is rife with gay and trans people facing instances of assault and torture according to the human rights watch okay wait this is confusing so egyptian actors trans son soon for instagram post about lgbt activist suicide there's so many things happening here Do you um, need me to break it down yeah okay so there's this famous television star and he recently came out as publicly welcoming and loving and celebrating his son's transition to be authentically himself as a man. Mm -hmm. Okay? So that got a lot of news recently. <clears throat> mm -hmm. And then this son of this famous actor posted on Instagram about the death, the suicide of this Egyptian lesbian who was exiled after she was released from prison for, mm -hmm. she was imprisoned for waving a pride flag at a pop concert when she was released. Imprisoned and tortured. Right? Yes. Yeah. And then she fled to Canada. And lived there for a few years before she unfortunately committed suicide recently. So he, this son of the actor, who's a part of the LGBT community. Yeah, he's a trans made, himself. Okay. Yes. He made a post about um, Sarah's death. Mm -hmm. And because he made a post in support of the community and about Sarah's death, he's being sued for what he put on his Instagram. By who? By two Egyptian lawyers. Okay. This the is... lawyers in Egypt are always responsible, seems like, not always, but they're suing people a lot or bringing yes. charges against people a lot because I think it was Sharif Geber was lawyers mm -hmm. and then uh, Muhammad Hisham was lawyers, plus he was on the TV show. There's been several lawyers that have brought charges against people. Okay. So, so I don't know how the laws in Egypt work, but in the civilized world, we have criminal laws and we have civil laws. When you're saying sue, but they're suing this person, you're, you're talking about civil laws? And if it is, I mean, over what damages? Like, if you are suing somebody with civil laws, you have to claim that you have caused damage to somebody. How are they going about proving that? I mean, these are lawyers, so they should be able to... Like, They're you made saying a post it hmm. destroys Egyptian values and religious beliefs. Um, it's a conspiracy to give up culture, spread uh, homosexuality among The support of some... Really, like, saying somebody... Who I don't know. I don't know if they're suing him in civil court or if they're suing him in... But I'm guessing. I don't know. It doesn't say. It says a lawsuit. So I'm assuming it's civil because right, okay. charges would be criminal probably. Yeah. Um, and it's really unfortunate. So this um, uh, actor's son, Salim, he wasn't available for a comment, but he made a second post recently um, saying that he was um, in you know poor mental health and that all the online criticism of Hagazi, the woman who died, has made him feel even more depressed. And he said, where is the mercy? Um, because obviously I can't speak Arabic, but other people are saying that, you know, in, um, Arabic speaking press, um, a lot of people are, um, basically celebrating her death. Um, it's really disgusting. Uh, yeah. Uh, Kiham, um, is in response to the lawyer saying that they are destroying Egyptian values. 
he or she is saying they are all living in shadows of what was once a great empire which was sub by islamic invaders sub oh subdued sorry um i mean egyptian values when they say they're destroying egyptian values they say that as if it's a bad thing <laughs> 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 I mean, they should like, yeah, d please. As it stands, Egyptian values destroying those is is a good thing for Egypt. It's in the best interest of e Egypt and Egyptian people. Yeah, uh, like we it should destroy the value of female genital mutilation. We should destroy the value of male genital mutilation. We should, hmm. yeah, destroy the and value any, of homophobia. Yeah, and anything that any values that come out of Islam. Basically, all of those should be destroyed. But like, how pathetic it is! Like, there are these lawyers are actually going over someone's Instagram post. Like, you guys, like, you guys are such, you know, have enough resources to deal. Like, oh my God, Egypt is trembling because of the like the foundations of this country. The values, of, like, is being threatened by an Insta by an Instagram post in support of somebody who's, you know, a, a, gay, a gay rights activist who committed suicide. Like, how, what does that say about your country if this is how it's, if this is what threatens? I mean, Sarah was thrown in jail and tortured for waving a pride flag. Right. You know? <laughs> Honestly, I think it's a nuisance value lawsuit, like, that they're purposely doing this to incite other people so that people will see what his post is even if people hadn't noticed it they can point to it and go look like that that's basically what um oops uh someone saying razan yasmin saying lawyers have sued actresses and belly dancers for acting and dancing yes yeah these are the same like and have have these lawyers said anything about the fact that the activist was tortured uh, and fallen in jail just for waving a gay flag. Do they see that as an issue that they need to speak at against? Probably not, right? Like that would, that would be in line with their values. These are the these are the values that are being threatened, right? They're like, how dare you? Like we in Egypt value torturing gay rights activists, and you are threatening or destroying these great values of ours. Right, God. those are the values they want to protect, I guess. <laughs> yeah, Jesus Christ, man. All right. Um, that was our last yeah. news. That was our last news. Thank you, guys. Guys, subscribe to our YouTube. If you're watching this on uh, Facebook, uh, hop over to our YouTube channel as well and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you're watching this on YouTube, hop over to our Facebook and follow our Facebook page as well and subscribe to our newsletter, link in the description. If you're on YouTube and you're already subscribed and you haven't hit the bell button, what the hell is wrong with you? Hit the bell button as well uh, and share these videos because our YouTube, because we said a whole bunch of things that we're not supposed to say. It triggers a lot YouTube. of things. A lot of things that a lot we're not of big like. Words. A lot of big words, a lot of naughty words that YouTube doesn't like. And because we say these things, our YouTube channel is not growing because YouTube is like suppressing our growth rate. So we need you guys to make it easy for us to be able to say the things that we want. So please help us grow our YouTube channel by sharing our videos. Even if you don't have a big following, sharing our YouTube videos just signals to YouTube that this might be an important channel. So it doesn't matter if you have don't have a big following. Just hit the share button and share wherever you want. Twitter, Facebook, um, you know, whatever. Tumblr, if that's still a thing. Um, <laughs> but yeah, like uh, Soha, thank you for saying that. Yes, please like and subscribe and share and all of that. Oh, uh, Razwan is saying thank you all. Uh, peace and love and F religions. Yes, I love that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Love you. I, Michael, I Mike, say... Michael, Michael on Facebook is being sarcastic about the U.S. trolls and saying the U.S. is worse than Egypt for gay people. Oh my god! Yeah, <laughs> he's joking. yeah, guys, he's joking. He's joking. But uh, you, yeah, I also want to say I usually end these videos by saying love all of you, but I don't love all of you. I only love the one of you that has clicked the subscribe 
and the bell button and like the video as well. Only you guys get my love. The rest of you, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. no love for for you guys. Anyway. But look at how easy it is to earn that love. So easy. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and if, right. if, if you don't earn my love, you're not going to get tortured in hell or anything like that. All right. Mm -hmm. All, All right. right. Safi. So, <laughs> bye, guys. Yeah. Bye. Yellow bye. Yalla. <laughs> Thank you for joining us. Subscribe to our channel. Hit the bell thingy. If you haven't, I don't know why. What has what's holding you back? Okay. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, why haven't you subscribed to our channel? Explain that to us, please. Like bell <laughs> and also if you if you're not getting notifications and stuff because YouTube is not telling people that we have shows because YouTube is like, oh, this person told us that they want to get your shows, right? They want to get your videos, but nah, you, we think it's no. And oh, look, oh, they also hit the bell button, but nah, you guys are too controversial. We want to show them mainstream stuff. We want to show them CNN or cat videos or whatever. But even there are people are like, no, we want to see Atheist Republic. And YouTube is like, no, nah, we don't think you want this. They're like, no, please show it to us. We say to you, we want to see Atheist Republic. And YouTube is like, no, we think we know what's better for you than you yourself. So to solve that, link there's a link in the description, uh, which is to our newsletter. So hopefully some of our, we could email it to you. So hopefully you get some of our content that way. Okay. So yeah, subscribe to our newsletter as well. And share, share our videos because... You know, we do get demonetized, that's an obvious, on every one of our videos, so F that, but we don't care about <laughs> that anymore. But we also get deprioritized, and that's even more damaging to us. Deprioritized, what does that mean? That means we're not, we don't show up on the suggested, you know, videos on the right, and all that, you know, on, the, on people's homepages, and that's how channels grow. Unfortunately, we can't grow, so we need you guys to share our videos 